Welcome back guys to another mukbang. <laughs> we are going back home today to my state. So we are making uh, Hawaii jar chicken bomba and fermented soybean um, porridge kind of. I have here homegrown organic uh, mustard greens. I just pick it up and um, we're going also going to do cabbage aromba. Singju with uh, dry meat. Um, and yeah, that's it. So, we see the Jackin Pomba Doshe. I do winter oil baggy. She the Karishu late they go. She do yam lucky oil ba. A in condesi lay on pan bago. Um, un should dab ning a city. I do un do heavy oil the biggie loin melt dogre. I do get a chee hangam shit. I can pick it up, you know. That's how you say yeah? Nothing is growing. Winter Hawaii Maroi mara lay the baguette. The chenka have share a little bit of rice. And I have here a little bit of this Asian chives. We went to Chinese market yesterday, nothing there. Right, baby? Right, baby. And a little bit of oil. Now we're just gonna mash this like this so that it will cook better when you cook. Yeah? When summer comes, we're gonna make this with uh, pea shoots, summer lakpaganda, Hawaii truck, no shoot, Hawaii truck, Kimanato, no shoot, when you go Hawaii truck, yam, targeting a she, come she, Hawaii mu pea shoot. Winter time, the curry shoot lady, of me, she did it. Curry shoot lady, go. Okay. Mash it up. If you want to know what is Asian chives, this you will find it in the Chinese market in Novi Beograd when the spring comes. But right now, there is nothing, there's no vegetables in the Chinese market. Nothing, nada, no hay nada. I have here bay leaves, cumin seeds. A little bit of hing. Yeah. Garlic and ginger. Onion. I got here a little bit of cougar chai fruit for my pot. Now we're gonna stir this um, until they are soft. Now let's add our mixed greens with the uh, rice. Now we're gonna keep stirring this until the, the rice changes color and also the greens are a little bit cooked. Let's keep uh, stirring it. Alright guys, the rice looks like it's starting to get softened. So, we are going to add our spices. We have here turmeric powder for color and Kashmiri chili powder. And some 
coriander powder and also we're going to add a little bit of chili flakes and some salt stir it well mix everything mix 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 now at this time I'm gonna add some uh, green peas Dry, uh, dry citrus, exotic citrus. Mix it well and some hot water. Now we are gonna cook this until the rice is cooked and fall apart. Okay, and we're gonna add the homemade Hawaii jar, fermented soybean. All right, continue cooking. Give you forever. All right, so while we are cooking our chicken bomba, we're going to make a romba. So I have here some mrok metpa. Chinese and then our boiled cabbage will be put below. Go be everybody. I'm 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 Mash, 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 mash. Yeah. If you are wondering about this recipe, this is Aromba is like one of Manipur's my state special side dish. Okay. It we kind of make this with any kind of vegetables. We really enjoy this side dish. You don't have to. <laughs> you don't have to like it, but it's very special for us. It's only for me. My husband will not eat this, so this is enough portion. How are you going? Mm, All right, guys, our chicken bomba is ready. As you can see, the rice is already cooked and falling apart, and the veggies are very cooked too. Now, what I'm gonna do here is, I'm just gonna add some dry, a little bit of dry uh, fish. You don't have to. Okay. Tastes awesome too. Yam how krego I go eat chicken bombas yet. All right, guys, we're going to make tarka here. Here I have some hot oil. Now let's add here. Since we don't have anything, we are going to add uh, dry chili, Asian chives and onion. Gonna burn a little bit, but that's okay. Now we're gonna add two teaspoons of this Hawaii jar, fermented soybean. Let's cook this a little bit without burning them. Okay. Oh, it smells beautiful. So nice. Chicken bomba is ready. 
I'm already go. She loyde who take this sinju though, she. All right. To make sinju, we have here as usual some uh, cabbage, shredded cabbage. And now we're gonna add some dry meat. We smoke this in the oven. And we're gonna add some garbanzo bean flour. We are not using any perilla today. Then some onion. Morokmet pa. Matek panese. Yam sha da ba. Chidi Hawaii shu hab roi, erum shu hab roi, kreshu leite tuki this potato chips hab shago. Baby, you wanna mix this up? Lomba kar hab shago ang shi. There you go, honey. We're gonna mash this up. All right, guys, we are ready. This is the gobi eromba. Cabbage romba and this is the chicken bomba. Chicken bomba. The singju. Kobi jamput. Kobi. Chak chai shuko. Ngasi di. Nasi. Yam nuwe de chai ni. Egi nu ba di yam chai ni ngasi di ko. Chapa horse. Let's eat. Hi guys. Hello. Welcome back to another mukbang. Like yesterday, we told you on our mukbang that we're gonna do a Manipuri dishes. We go back to my state again. Mm. And we do chakin bomba. This is um very um traditional. popular mm. and traditional. Okay, it's kind of uh, like if I have to explain it to you, it's like a uh, porridge. Porridge, yeah. Yeah, with uh, green peas and a lot mm. of veggies, greens, and uh, stinky uh, soybean, mm. which is awesome. Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and here today we make sinju with just cabbage, garbanzo bean flour, and uh, uh, beef jerky. And parmigiano. No, no parmigiano, baby. Oh, and yeah, here chips. cabbage aromba <laughs> for the first time. I keep hitting my head on that. And here champut, boil, winter cabbage, so good. And some leftover chutney for me. So, Japa Horishiko. She does the curry curry like rock and day. Okay, baby, ready? Ready. Here. That's a perfect accent. Excellent job. If you find anything like this in there, What's don't that? eat it, okay? What That's a that? citrus to give some aroma into mm. the flavor. Wait! You said you're not gonna give me Here, anything. here. Try this one, baby. This is cabbage aromba. Yeah. You're gonna eat or not? A little bit. Yeah. There you go. So, mm. mostly vegetarian again today, yeah? Mostly. Kobi jamput leye, kobi aromba dore. Kobi ngap dore, kobi shida sinju leye. Oh, Jesus. I said everything is cabbage today, mm. but look at that, you guys! How mm. beautiful that is! Yeah, we cannot always keep on eating only meat, right? Yeah. So, what do mm. you say? Bon appetit, baby. Bon appetit. Mm. Oh, that's hot. Welcome to a chewing show. <laughs> it's gonna be chewing a lot. Uh huh. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The taste of the Orient. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Nice. Breaking the game. Good job. Mm. Wow. Mm. This is good. Baby. Which one? Chicken bomba. Mm-hmm. It's good, right? Yeah. It's like what every kid in in Europe hates the the peas, like you know the veggies. Uh -huh. Yeah. And then when you grow up, you tend to like them.
Take a small bite of this. What is it? Citrus. No. Exotic citrus, baby. Mm. Mm. Not because of that, but because I'm like... Small one. Mm, okay. Do not the aroma, baby. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. I did that. For us, we use a lot of this kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. To season our food or meat or meal, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Without using a lot of oil mm -hmm. or spices. This is awesome, baby. Mm. Are you okay? Oh, yes, baby. Mm. I'm more than okay. dream food really <laughs> not too much chewing a lot of taste not too soft but there's lots of chewing with the sinjo yes but big not, bite you know what i mean not a lot of chewing everything is pretty soft mm. Mm. <coughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Do you often make these kind of combinations? Sinju with um, Chuck and Bomba and. Mm -hmm. Me? Mm -hmm. to be Back in your place. To be honest with you, baby, I have no idea. Ta <laughs> Anyway. No, because. This is mostly, this recipe is mostly eaten by the valley people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. People from the valley that I told you all the time, yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm just learning it after having um, YouTube. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. <coughs> I belong to Tanku tribe and our way of cooking is very simple. Mm. So you are people of the mountains and they are people mm -hmm. of the valley. Mm -hmm. mm. 
Luca. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm so full. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm perfect. Actually. You guys, sometimes in some mukbang, I keep on looking at this plate. <laughs> and then some of you will say that it's so creepy that the wife keep on looking at this plate, but I have to teach him how to eat. Yes. And like today, I don't look at it because I know he can eat this on his own. Yeah. But there's some food that I have to teach him. I have to keep on looking at it like, oh no, not like that, you know? Mm -hmm. It's a new concept for me. That's the only reason. Because I, until I get married and until you start making food, I thought you take fork and spoon and you eat any any food in any order, any way, and it should be tasty. Mm -hmm. You know? But now with you, I know that combining certain things makes a different taste again. Mm -hmm. It opens up my palais. Mm. 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 Because after half an hour, I'm coming back. <laughs> For real? <laughs> yeah. So good. We're not giving anything to the neighbor today because she said she just want to eat simple salad. Seems like her stomach is not good, yeah? Oh, she wants to lose weight, she told me. Oh. She wants okay. to be healthy and lose weight. That's okay. what she told me. That's perfect. She says, I'm already walking 30 minutes because of the dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And she says, I'm always on the highest sun. That's 30 minutes of sun. And then... That's good. Now, she's going to switch to salads and one time only, like okay. one in a week, some okay. food. So when I make... <coughs> I'll give her only when I make healthy food. This can be healthy too, but... If they don't know how to eat this? Yeah, it can be. Uh huh. Just this or just this or. Oh, sh how I jar gumbadi? She give me the bibudu. Kara comfortable oil deco. Moi, she manam she kara. I'm saying like, um, I'm not comfortable to give them this. Mm -hmm. Because it has uh, fermented soybean. Mm -hmm. Wow. But in a way, people think that, um, what is that called in Japanese, baby? They're from Venezuela. Mm. Everybody knows that. I don't know. And most people are okay with that. And it's also from Venezuela, but. Wait, Japanese? But for us, it's, if it belongs to us, it's not okay. What's the fermented soybean in Japanese? The koi is something I forgot. Uh, something. Mm -hmm. It's almost the same physics the way they make mm -hmm. the fermented soybean. Wow, this was amazing, right? Yeah. Oh, that's it. Well, Loira. Loira. Yam chare. Yam chare. Book talle. Yeah. Say, say. <laughs> Book talle. Book. Book talle. 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 You have to be rough, like mm. talle. 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 Oh, talle, baby. Talle. <laughs> oh my god! Well, thank you for joining us. Uh, <laughs> okay, try this and this in combination with this. It's amazing, yeah? 
Chuck and Bomba, Sing Ju, and Eromba, Eromba from Jambut. If you're wondering about this uh, uh, fermented soybean, I have a recipe on my blog. It's very easy and it's probiotic. Okay? Yeah. So even for us kidney disease people, our dietitian suggests this to eat as a probiotic, including um, kimchi and yeah, this one. Yeah, sure. But you have to be careful with the sodium. This one doesn't have any sodium. Yeah, if no can. sodium. Just boil, wrap it, and then ferment it. Ferment, yeah. That's it. Wow. <sighs> Sign off, guys. Thanks so much for watching, nice everybody. Nice to meet you all. <laughs> Thank you for joining us for dinner. And uh. I'm gonna share it. Hey. Yum nung ayre ko. Say yum nung ayre. Yum nung yum nung ayre. Nung ayre. Nung ayre. Yum. I'm gonna. Hmm. I'm gonna share it. What's a muka una sheko? We'll see you later. See you again. A muka una sheko. Oh. Someone we now say. Ay, ay. Try, baby, try, try. Second. Sampang we now say. Sampang we now say. So. Yeah. Okay. I'll get there. I'll get there in a thousand weeks. Pirmi lenge. Pirmi lenge. Tanyabad. Tanyabad, yeah? I, I know those things, yeah, because we use them here often. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> See you next time, you guys. Thank you, guys. See you. Thanks for watching. Bye.